Hello everyone, this is going to be an unboxing and review of the Bayite temperature controller available on Amazon with links below. I've been using this thermostat to heat a brooder with electric lights for about a month now and I've been really pleased with it. This is a uh, thermostat, electronic thermostat, that can control both heating and cooling. You'll notice when it gets plugged in, it immediately goes into error mode. That's because the, the sensor needs to be plugged in. Currently, this is showing me uh, temperature of the room. Okay, so what I want to show you now is what I'm trying to get to. I have a box that I'm trying to heat with baby chicks in it, and I want to keep the heat in this brooder box between 85 and 90 degrees. Lights on to heat at 85. Lights off to stop heating at 90. And I'm going to hold the set button until SV comes on up here. It looks like a SU, but I guess it's supposed to be an SV. And then I'm going to use the up and down buttons to set my top temperature. Then I'm going to hit set again. Now this is showing the differential between that top temperature of 90 degrees and how low you want it to be able to fluctuate. I want it to go all the way down to 85. So in this case, I'm going to increase this number to 5. The temperature will flux between 85 and 90 degrees. Okay. Now to proceed, I will hit the power button, which will take it back to the home screen. We're going to test it. I'm going to actually hold this probe, which will begin to increase with my body temperature. And right now you can see that since the temperature is 73, 74, the heat is on. So in other words, power to this heating outlet is now on and active. You can see the temperature rising rapidly. Okay, it's up to 90 and you can see that the heating element is now turned off. So now I'm going to take this away from here. Now we can see the temperature dropping and when it gets down below 85 we'll look for the heating lamp to come on. There it came. I'd like to show you how to set an alarm. If the temperature gets up as high as 95 degrees I would like an alarm. What we do first is press and hold the set button. Continue clicking the set button until you see AH, alarm high. I'm going to take it down to 95 degrees. Now we're back. So I'm going to take and put this, I'm going to hold on to this, getting higher. And there's your high alarm. There's one last thing I want to mention, and that is I really like that this unit has a safety cutoff switch so that if it gets overloaded, uh, you'll save your unit by cutting off. And you can simply click it again to reset Finally, it. There's a Bible verse, a soft answer turneth away wrath, but grievous words stir up anger. Thanks for watching.